What do you think about this initiative? I think it's a marvellous idea, it's something that I will support in future years as well and it's also um, inspired me to volunteer on a regular basis. Thank you. What were the outcomes for you? For me, um, I actually went back to my scout pack and I talked to them about my experience. The scouts set themselves a challenge of um, raising 400 tins for the um, food bank. So it was about giving back to the community even more and inspiring further. And Jack, what did it mean for you to be able to volunteer? Uh, it meant uh, volunteering for me naturally creates a positive self-attitude. Uh, it felt good to be able to contribute and help other people that may need uh, a little bit of help at certain times of the year. What did you actually do during your volunteering day? So I volunteered to help the Salvation Army, which is a charity which helps the homeless or the poor. Uh, during my day volunteering, I helped him set up the market stall, the Christmas market stall on Birkhead Market. So I helped him erect uh, some shelving, uh, wire some lights up and decorate the uh, general market stall with ball balls and uh, drapes of material and just general tasks like that. How do you think your actions contributed to Storengi? My volunteering work raised the profile of Storengi UK within the local community. It's not often a company enables its employees to do volunteering, volunteering work within work hours. Ben, can you tell us a little about your experience shadowing a colleague? So I shadowed one of the on-site mechanical engineers for the day. Uh, where we, we went round and I was able to see the gas coming from the National Transmission Service all the way through to the storage caverns and the drying equipment we have here on site. Um, I was really able, I was able to observe the maintenance activities that we carry out here and gain a better appreciation for the overall site here at Stub Black. I nominated Ollie for an Employee Excellence Award to show my appreciation for his general caring attitude and hard work. I have worked with Ollie for around nine months. During this time, Ollie has been keen to learn and often asked if he can help with tasks above and beyond his normal role. It was a surprise to receive this recognition award as I felt I was only doing my job. I would like to thank Paul. It is great to be working in a team as good as this. Um, I received a Length of Service Award for five years service with Star and G. Um, it's nice to feel appreciated for the work that I've done in that time and it was a great compliment to me to receive a recognition from the How does Storange UK choose its charity each year? Each year we ask the staff to vote th between three to four different uh, local charities and the most popular one is selected for us to support throughout the year. How do we support the chosen charity throughout the year? We organise different fundraising events that the whole team can get involved in. In 2019, saw us um, raise money through a bikeathon, a bake-off. We sold veg that we'd grown here on site and eggs kindly donated by members of the team. Um, it's a great way for the whole team to get involved and raise money for our charity. Hello. I'm Brian Roberts from Age UK Cheshire. I'd like to thank Louise Mason and her colleagues at Store Energy UK for enthusiastically supporting us during 2019, organising a range of fundraising activities at their site and elsewhere, and supporting us with our sensory garden project at Castle Community Centre. 
the support and the funds raised are very much appreciated to help us help older people across Cheshire. Thank you. This project takes our employee engagement programme beyond the paycheck. It fosters a real sense of engagement, giving our employees the freedom to perform, to grow and learn new skills and to make a difference in our local communities. The benefits, boosting morale, creating awareness across our teams and a keen sense of recognising our values in the wider organisation. <laughs>